Later on, when John the Baptist starts his ministry and starts to baptize people into water, Jesus comes to John's baptism and when John dips him into water, the scripture says that Jesus prayed in Luke chapter 3. It says, as he prayed, Holy Spirit came upon Jesus and filled Jesus. So we see Jesus was being born by the Holy Spirit, but we also see now Jesus being filled with the Holy Spirit. And this is different. That just because you are saved and Holy Spirit lives in you, the Bible also says that as Christians we must continuously be filled with the Holy Spirit. We are filled with the Holy Spirit. Many times we think, well, Holy Spirit is going to fill me when Holy Spirit wants to fill me. But the scripture compares being filled with Holy Spirit equivalent to like a drunken being filled with liquor or with alcohol. Now an alcoholic doesn't sit at home and wait for alcohol to come from the bar into his house, knock the door, go through his living room, jump on his lap and fill his body with liquid. That, that's not how it happens. You don't get drunk on accident. Being drinking is a choice. You get up, you go to the place where the bottle is and you drink it. To be filled with Holy Spirit is actually not a chance, it's a choice. It's a choice you make where you put yourself like Jesus in the place of prayer and you open your heart to God, you open your life to God and then God's Spirit fills you. To simply be preoccupied with the things of life and expect that somehow, somewhere when I'm going to be driving or somehow, somewhere when I'm depressed, stressed and just brought down, God just going to fill me with Holy Spirit. That is an illusion. Being filled with Holy Spirit is a command and it's a choice we make. It's not something that just spontaneously happens to the lucky few. It's just something that we make as a decision to be in God's prayer, to be in God's Word and Holy Spirit fills us as a result. Alcoholics don't get filled with alcohol because alcohol is so demanding. No. Yes, the alcohol attracts them and draws them in but at the end of the day it is their choice and that's exactly how it is to be with Holy Spirit. Now Holy Spirit is not like alcohol. Alcohol is water. It doesn't have a person but Holy Spirit is a person but Holy Spirit wants to fill you. Just like an alcoholic, a drunken is filled with alcohol. It is your choice.